Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever and whenever you are. My name is John, or Last Frontier Bricks, and welcome to episode 16 of this 100% playthrough of LEGO Marvel Avengers. Just like last time, it's rather ironic that they actually gave us Phil Coulson as one of the characters as soon as I jumped into the game. Considering today, we instead of going on to the next movie, we will actually be doing the level based off of Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Reasons for that is, uh, the specific episodes mm, that uh, the level covers... Ooh! This is a version of this is a version of Colson with the straw gun. Nice. Uh, anyway, as I was saying, uh, the specific episodes that uh, the L Agents of Shield level covers take place right after uh, a Age of Ultron at the end of season two of Agents of Shield. While the next uh, movie level, well, last movie level, Ant Man takes place during the season two and three gap. So, uh, so, that's why we will be doing it next. So, without any further ado, let's go ahead and head up into space to get ready to start the level. Alright, here we are in space. Although, technically... They, gave, they dropped us in on the Black Panther level. Let's see. Okay, there's Sokovia. Let's see. There's New York. There we go. There. There we go. There's Coulson. Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Let's go ahead and get started. This is Agent Melinda May with a special S.H.I.E.L.D. report. The following information is highly classified and should only be accessed by agents with experience of... Season 2 events. You have been spoiler warned. It has become apparent that our new recruit Sky has some secrets. Ones revealed during a mission to a buried alien city. We had no way of knowing that the transforming alien technology we found would cause S.H.I.E.L.D. itself to fracture. Sky's gifts came from her father, a villainous doctor with a ruthless bedside manner, and her mother, an energy vampire bent on starting a war with S.H.I.E.L.D. What she didn't anticipate was that someone had called in the cavalry. Me. All right. Wonderful introduction by Ming Na Wen, aka Melinda May, who, as far as I know, is the only. Things were going well. Oh. We were outnumbered, and many of our best agents had been compromised. Dar darn it, May. The mission directive had changed. Our priority was now to infiltrate the Inhuman Complex and extract the remaining agents. Darn it, May! Why'd you have to go and ruin my beautiful introduc my beautiful introduction for you? Anyway, as I was saying, as far as I know, Ming Na Wen, who plays Melinda May here, is the only actor that I know has has played in all of Disney's Big Three. She voiced. Mulan in the animated version of it and even got a cameo at the end of the live action which came out a few years ago and now she has also played Fennec Shand in Star Wars during the Mandalorian, Book of Boba Fett and even the Bad Batch so yeah quite the accomplishment for one actor to play all play in all three of Disney's big fa franchises: Disney itself, Marvel, and Star Wars. So, we are so obviously we have Agent May here. Who's our other character? Ah, Gemma Simmons. Nice. Although I think I'll be sticking with May for a while. She is one of my personal favorites. Quite the story for that character. Wonderfully done. Yeah, if you guys haven't seen Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., you absolutely should. The entire show, they have completed the entire show, so you can watch the entire show now. And it should be. And it should be on Disney Plus now. If not, if, if not, it should still be on Netflix. So yeah, definitely check it out. Very, I've watched basically the entire series, basically the entire show. Absolutely recommend it. Hmm. 
Count that more than that would happen. I mean, come on, we didn't even get any studs out of that. Alright, what we got here? There we go. That one actually he giving us some studs. And one more. There we go. Hey! Didn't know it was this area. Hey, lots of get here before us. Uh, anything else uh, anything else around here? Ooh, nice touch. They even have the Agents of Shield music going on. Alright. So, it looks like this area is about as clear as we can make it. We don't have any character that can dig, unfortunately. Something about this doesn't add up. Hey Simmons, can you uh can you? You can. Nice. Hey, that's Daisy! Orders are orders. And she was in the way. I believe that's also Lincoln there. Lincoln Campbell, by the way, if as you guys are wondering, he sh should be the one, if I remember right, he's the one making all the electricity here. Yep, that's him. Although I don't remember him being able to fly. With the Inhumans distracted, we seized the opportunity to rescue our fellow agents, but the mission was far from over. So yeah, for, for those of you who haven't watched Agent of S.H.I.E.L.D., they are the ones who introduced the Inhumans. They are a... A branch... a branch off of... A uh, few minutes with alien uh, DNA, specifically that of the Cree. Specifically that of the Cree. You may remember the M from Rome from Ronan the Accuser from Guardians of the Galaxy Volume One. So yeah, this alien DNA it grants them as various superpowers. For example, as I said, Lincoln Campbell can produce electricity, while Sky, aka Daisy Johnson, aka Quake, is able to produce earthquake. It's able to create earthquakes. Alright, so what we got going on around here? It's been a while since I played this level. So yeah, Daisy's probably the one who made this rock barrier. Ow, ow, ooh. Ouch. Okay, okay, okay. I'm backing off. I'm backing off. Someone's gonna Then I was thinking it was up there and it definitely cost me.
Also, if you guys have watched uh, the Miss Marvel show that just finished up a few weeks back, uh, technically she is, according uh, according to Marvel lore, she's actually supposed to be an Inhuman. So actually, I was surprised when uh, they uh, when they kind of teased her, teased at the end of the show that she was actually supposed to be a, a mutant. Alright, so, let's see. Well, wait, one, two, where's, where's the third? There it is, and four. Alright, what we got going on here? Oh, did we put out, is it putting out the fire? Yeah, yeah, it's a water pump. Uh, I was kind of hoping I'd be able to. Whoa, what the? Oh, quit bond. Oh, that's what that. That's what the wood's supposed to be. It's a wrecked ship. Up in the middle of the koi pond. Alright, so that's one shield agent freed. This should be number two. Now, I imagine we'll probably need Gemma for this. Oh, maybe not. Th uh, it's gonna be like one of the uh the uh the computer puzzles, so I thought we might need a smart one for that. Sky's new friend may have had an electric personality, but there really wasn't any excuse for his shocking behavior. We wouldn't be able to reach him from the ground, so we had to take a different approach. Hey, how do we get over there? Oh. Seriously, though, how do we get over there? There we go. That's more like it. Huh? Two of five? Why don't we get one of five? He really doesn't want us around, does he? Hmm. Yeah, I gotta admit that uh, the target thing caught me by surprise. Uh, unless this, unless this, uh, this map goes beyond this that rock wall, I have no idea what the other three could be. Incoming. The area around us was becoming more dangerous. So much for the scenery.
Yeah, let's clear this area out. Kind of surprised they aren't giving me anything to build. Or with all the parts I'm breaking. I got plenty of I got plenty of hours on this game. Uh, just yes, yeah. Let's go ahead. We clear this area as well. well. Jiang Ying and Sky were always just out of reach. Technically, our name is Daisy. Hey, that was number four. The targets. Let's see if we can find number five. Hmm. Was there anything else on that? Well, there's another stud. Alright, uh, was there anything on the... Anything left to... Up here? I thought this might be... Where we need to go to... Get farther in, but nope. Kind of weird that they have shield computers in the in Human City. Wait your turn, Gemma. Just as we were in range of Sky, we confirmed what Shield has suspected all along. I yeah. They are not going to let me in there unless I'm playing a Hydra Agent. Agent May, log entry 1129. Zhang Ying revealed her true colors, but it was too late to stop the attack. Sky's mother wasn't the only monster in the family. Her father, Cal, had now become even more dangerous. I just hope I'm not invited to their next family reunion. 
Yeah, these guys are messy. Had been attacking agents on board for only a few seconds, but the entire quadrant had already been compromised. Good thing Shield had been working on quantum entanglement technology over the last year. All right, so it looks like we have Leopold Fitz and Daisy Johnson. Nice. And uh, for your information, the uh, the, uh, the Inhuman Gordon that May just mentioned is sick. Is sick is teleportation, though it happened to. Uh, although unfortunately, his the power waking cost him his sight. Gordon was too fast for our agents. I could have caught him if I'd had the chance. Ah, looks like we got the bus here. The bus, um, for those of you who don't don't know, is uh, Colson's team's main method of transportation. An awesome, pl uh, this awesome uh, cargo plane. All right, hey Daisy. What? Daisy gets a. She gets a nicer. She doesn't get her earthquake powers, man. Fitz had been running some diagnostic tests on three prototype quantum field disruptors. Hopefully, they could be used to limit Gordon's dimensional warping powers, meaning he wouldn't be able to get away. There's a Stan Lee around here. There he is. In that Project Reaper Flight Chamber. How do I get myself in these crazy situations? Looks like someone wanna put him on us. Unfortunately, we don't seem to have Whoa. Ah, maybe Daisy does. Ha maybe Daisy does have her pow earthquake powers. Hmm, I was kind of hoping I might be able. To, we we might be able to use that to get stand free. Unfortunately, that's, that doesn't seem to be the case. Nope, that's one of the emitters. So we, so we want to keep that at intact. I know you could stand. I know. Access granted. What'd that do? Oh. Darn it. Woke it up, but it's still need some repairs. God, how annoying Gordon could be.
Hey, what we got here? Alright, so we got that one built up. Imagine we'll need fits for that. Here's the technical genius of the Fitzsimmons pair. Come on. Okay, come on. go and there we go all right that one's all powered up one down two to go ah! well at least we didn't lose the suds There we go, that's two. Oh, I better know how to break this. Or do I? Hello. Nice. Hmm, I wonder if that we could use that to freestand. Let's check out. Right, let's find out. Nope, no luck. I'm trying to, but I can't don't know how. Hey, what's going on in here? Well, there's Daddy Dearest. Oh, well, that has something for one. <laughs> something more for Wanda to use. Imagine we'll probably actually be coming in here later. If I remember right, we do get a bit, bit of a boss fight each with AC's dad. Hey, look! We actually got a first mini kit. Go ahead and put this back together. <laughs> Alright, and that. There we go. Alright. Ooh, detergent crystals.
The Terrigen Mist was toxic to humans, but Sky's inhuman genetics gave her an advantage. Hello, Agent Coulson. Long time no see. Director Coulson's genius plan may have cleared the mist, but it also disrupted the power. Fitz wanted to search for Sky, but we had more immediate threats to deal with. N namely, <laughs> Daisy's class Yang A dad. Yang us her ex, Cal, as a prisoner, but he turned out to be another pawn in her game. Incoming! Oh. Oh, duck on it. Why couldn't we have had Coulson earlier? We could have used him to... Break and get the, the metal parts. Instead of him earlier. Anyway, at least we got True Avenger. All right, director. What we got here? Coulson had ordered us to take down Cal gently. Wouldn't have been my call. I think we got him. Ah, uh, can't have gotten him. That'd be too easy. Get him? Agent May, log entry 1130. After trapping Dr. Zabo, Director Coulson used Cal's family connections to subdue the more beastly side of his nature. With Zabo on our side and S.H.I.E.L.D. finally working as a team, the rest was just cleaner. This is not the last we'll see of the Inhumans, but at least our team made it out intact. Where's Simmons? On a whole new world, May. On a whole new world. Alright, so that finishes Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. And that brought our star total up to 3,923,720. Woo! That's a lot of suits! We very fortunately get True Avenger there at the end. Unfortunately, we were unable to save Stan Lee and only got one mini kit. So, not our best showing. But with the level complete and True Avenger, I think that got us two more gold bricks. Uh, we'll help out later, Er Colson. But for now, this will be the end of this video. Thank you for joining me for it. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, ring the bell to be notified of all videos as soon as we come a they become available. Check out my channel and the entire LEGO Marvel Avengers playthrough playlist on the end screen in just a few seconds. And I'll see you guys in the next video where we will do the level for Ant-Man. Later, everybody.